It's that time. Indie with kids. Hey, welcome back to Indie Now. A lifestyle and Indianapolis family expert, Katie Mann from Indie with Kids, is here to share some of the best Easter egg hunts happening around town this weekend and some ideas to spice up your at home Easter egg hunt. Hi, Katie. Hi. Thank you for my Easter bunny ears yes, right here. They match perfectly. I'm loving this. <laughs> So I'd love for you to open up an egg. Go ahead okay. and grab one, and yeah, up, let's egg. see what's going on this weekend. And this is all glittery and fun. I know. Aren't they gorgeous? They're gorgeous. Okay, I'm gonna open up this egg. Ooh. Okay. It says Easter eggs travaganza at the Teeter Farm. Okay, so that's happening Saturday. It's a free egg hunt from 10:30 to 2 at that's Teeter fun. Farm. You can find all this information on Indie with Kids, of course. They have games, crafts, inflatables, and then of course an Easter egg hunt because that's what we're there for. How cute. So definitely check that it's one free, out. You know? It's free, yes. This one says Spring Fling Egg Hunt at Lawrence. So this is happening in a park. You do have to pre-register. Information on Indie with Kids, it is free, but you do have to pre-register. And they have it divided up into, in, into age groups for the egg hunt. So oh, there's not fun. that like, well, there will still be that craziness, but oh, absolutely, <laughs> yeah, it's going to be wild and really fun. But just remember, guys, these are free egg hunts. If you only get one yeah. egg, you know, be happy. It's about the experience. <laughs> yes, more than anything, exactly. You know? All right, here we go. Next one. I love this idea. I know. This is it's so, so cute. fun. The reveal. So, Indie 11 halftime egg hunt. Yeah. Halftime egg hunt. Okay, so this That's one cool. is yeah. also free with your ticket. You do need to have a ticket to the game. This is for kids age 13 and under. You need to pre-register at Indie11.com slash promotions, and then your kid can participate in a halftime egg hunt. That which, would be cool. And they're providing the bags, so you don't have to lug a bag oh, in or nice. a basket. You just go and, and play. And to be just out on the field, I that know. would be a really How fun experience fun is for that? the kids. Yeah. I just love the differences. Indiana Comic Convention Easter Egg Hunt. So They're having one too? They are, so you okay. do have to have a ticket to yeah. go, but they have it divided up into different age groups. Again, they're giving out bags to the first people who get there in those nice. age groups. So definitely go check that one out. Awesome. We've got one more. Yeah, one more egg. One more egg. And it says the egg extravaganza at Indianapolis Baptist Temple. I love this one because it's taking that um, trunk or treat idea and turning it to Easter. They're going to decorate their cars and kids will go from trunk to trunk. So there's not that mad dash and that scramble. Ooh. A little bit more calm. So A little more calm. A yeah. little more calm. <laughs> and then if you're having an egg hunt at home this weekend, I have a couple ideas for you to spice Ooh, it up. Okay. My kids are getting older, so we're having to like make it more fun to get yeah. everyone involved. What are your kids' ages again? Um, we have five, seven, nine, and 11. We're the odds this year. They're so so. Cute. Yeah. <laughs> So here's one where they can go and find only eggs that have letters that match their name. Oh, so then they want nice. to spell out their name. So I have yours here. Your name would be harder than spelling out Ryan's. <laughs> right, right. He would get there very quickly. Oh, that's so cute. Thank that way you. you have kids that can, like, if they have different age groups, they have a way of having their own opportunity to get eggs. Nice. This is one we do every year with our, in our neighborhood. It's a glow-in-the-dark egg hunt. You can buy Easter eggs that glow in the dark or you can take your regular ones and shove glow-in-the-dark things into them. They also sell oh, little nice. tiny lights that you can put into them, and it's a ton of fun. And that then this one fun. is one that we're gonna try this year. We've never done oh, this. Oh yeah? This is Easter egg hunt tag. So oh. you decorate a shirt with eggs, and you can hot glue them. I use these little Velcro command strips. Yeah. They'll just rip right They'll off. They'll like rip off of them. And you have someone be it, and everybody has to chase them to get their Easter eggs. <laughs> okay, that is so funny. So, yeah, Kerrigan says we're going to play in the studio. It's a oh commercial break. Gosh. Yeah, this is so cute. So yeah, there's just Velcro right here, yeah. and they pop right off. So easy see. and oh, so much neat. fun. So those are my what ideas a for a idea. spin on your normal egg hunt, yeah. plus some community egg hunts that you guys can go to this weekend. Way to mix it up. Hey, if people want to get these reminders and just see all the fun events, how can they find you, IndieWithKids.com. Yep. Find us on social media and online. Thank you so much. So much, Katie. We got that information right there on your screen. These are really fun ideas. 